Hello everybody and Happy New Year to you all. Today Lincoln City took on Blackpool. Unfortunately I couldn't make it to the game due to family commitments and not wanting to go all the way to Blackpool. Nothing against her, it's just big skeg. But yeah, no, I was busy, I couldn't make it, but I did watch the game on iFollow and I thought I'd just do a recap of the game just as I saw it. And I was, I was writing down some notes as we went through. I was going to do a video before the game about a formation change and how I would have gone for the 5-3-2. I mentioned this in my last video and how I would have put Makama in a delicate up front and then played more of a three in the middle and five at the back and lo and behold that's pretty much what they did but I thought it worked you know I thought Adelican at the beginning he had a lot of the ball he was playing well he was running down the left loads he's got a wicked pace I thought he maybe could have put some crosses in where he didn't but the fact that he was getting onto the ball where he was was a lot better than what we were used to getting like which was just lump the ball up to a lone striker and have no one to give it to. And the great thing is, Makama was winning headers. Uh, he, he did some great little knockdowns. He was just he was just a nuisance, which was good. He's big, he's strong. He's just running at the defences, putting them under pressure. Uh, shame that we couldn't get a goal in those first 15 minutes, though, because I thought they both played really well up front. We had a couple of shots that sort of dribbled past the post. Uh, I think it was Hamilton who took a volley in it, it just didn't really connect with it. I do think we need more crosses though. We started to put them in, but we didn't really put them in high enough. We were like more low driven crosses that didn't really do it for me. If we stick one up high and get McCarmer on the end of it, I'm sure he's going to win a header and put it away. He, he could be a beast, this guy. He's built for it. We're just not giving him the ball where he needs it, I think. I wrote down that it was nice to see us actually having shots, which I thought, like... I was expecting just to be sat there, bored, watching us pass it, lose it, and defend with nine players behind the ball. But it was nice to be attacking and actually go for it, and it made it interesting to watch. And despite losing 2-0, at least the first half, at least, was fun to watch. Their goal really came against the run of play, almost. That we were pretty much dominating in terms of chances and getting the ball forward, and then they had a free kick and won the header. Nice header across the goalkeeper. Puts Blackpool up. Shame that it's come from a set piece. We need to be winning those headers. And then that was the end of the first half, really. Nothing else happened. And then the second half started, and we were terrible. Absolutely useless. Just slow. The 50th minute, they scored again. Or oh, they, sorry, they nearly scored again from a from another set piece. Should have gone in, like whipped ball in. Could have even been a diving header. I can't remember. It was a header or a diving header or something. Just went wide. Uh, we finally had our first shot on target in the 53rd minute, which wasn't bad. It was low and it was to the keeper, so it didn't really do much. But it was a shot. I think it was Dylan Duffy cutting in on his right, having a shot at the keeper. There wasn't much to it, but it was nice to see us have a shot. And you could hear the Lincoln fans in the background cheering almost sarcastically that we'd had a shot, which is never good to hear. However, I went on to say... Mikama looking like it's his best game so far in Lincolnshire and I, I do stand by that I think he had a really good game today despite us not scoring I thought he played really well he did well just to, to get onto the ball and be a nuisance and he, he ran down the right wing and took on a couple of players into the box and then tried to get a cross in the cross was blocked but it was really good it was like actually good play uh, and then Sorensen got injured excellent I haven't heard much about it yet I've recorded this as soon as the game's finished Hopefully it's not a bad one. I then wrote that the match got boring, and to be honest, the last 25 minutes was just dull. It was like end-to-end, -end, but nothing happened. If anything, they looked the better team. They were going to score the goals. Then the second goal. <laughs> it's a shame for Ioma, because I like Ioma. He's decent. He's. I didn't like him last season. I didn't like him at the start of this season, but he's really turned it around. He's become one of my favourite players in the shirt. He's, he's just... He seems to show some passion and he just, unfortunately, it's one of those defensive errors which I'm sure he'll hate as well. We all don't want to see it, but he just badly controlled the ball, tried to pass it to the side. Their player picked it up and it was a one-on-one -on -one with the keeper. I thought Jensen did well to get out and got a foot to it, but just not enough to put it wide. And then in the 95th minute, the very last kick of the game, pretty much they should have made it three. And he just lobbed it over him and it hit the crossbar. Should have been three nil. So those are my thoughts. Let me know what you think below. I still think that 5-3-2 could work. Despite losing, it was the most forward attacking game that we've had in ages. We also have a break now. Our next game is postponed due to Shrewsbury, 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 Shrewsbury being in the FA Cup. 
against Wrexham. So our game is cancelled and we've got a game the week after. That game is away at Wickham Wanderers, a team that I think we can beat. <laughs> I say that, I don't think we can beat them. It's just such such a bad run of games. I don't think we've won in ages. I mean, our form, just looking at it quickly, is lost, draw, loss, 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 loss. So it's not it's not great, is it? It's, it's relegation form, it's terrible. We've just got to hope that we can do something to turn it around. Let me know what you thought of the game down below and what you would do to change this Lincoln squad to get us back into winning ways. And if anyone would like to subscribe, I'd really appreciate that. Thanks again, and bye-bye.